What up, man? This is your boy Shotek360 from Manos.com, and here we go with some gameplay uh, playing a racist player here in Madden 16. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my complete adjustments on defense. So, so you guys can go ahead and check it out if you guys need any help with anything. So, here we go. We're gonna go ahead and get started. Uh, notice that we're coming out and off, and coming out in the ground and pound. We're gonna go ahead and try to run to the outside, and notice that we get really nice blocking, and we get a first down with Lynch. Again, I'm gonna go ahead and combine it with the run and the pass. If he can't stop it, especially because he's coming out like in a 4-3, hey, I'm gonna go ahead and keep doing my thing. And especially if he's in zone coverage, I already got my zone beaters, man beaters, everything. And notice right here, we're gonna go ahead and throw to the wheel rod in circle against zone coverage, and we get a nice yard uh, for a first down. So we're gonna go ahead and keep it up. Again, wide open. He does not know how to lock this shit up. So he's kind of inexperienced in adjusting right here on defense. We're gonna go ahead and continue now. What I like to do, I like to set up my defense before I go into the game. I don't just go in there and just play with stock playbook. Uh, I like to set up and adjust my players. I like to put my, my fastest linebackers at defensive ends and uh, D-line. Uh, I like to get my fastest defensive uh, tackle, uh, defensive ends at defensive tackle. So uh, depending on the side that I'm blitzing, I like to do that. So depends. Uh, that's how the blitzes work, in case you didn't know. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and set up here. We're coming out in the 4-3 defensive uh, um, right here, as you guys can see, 4-3 defense, and we got a nice blitz coming off the edge. Now, we do have the 4-3 defense out already and available at madanoster.com. Go check that out if you guys uh, are wondering how to run this. Now, I like to come out in cover 4, cover 3, cover 2, and I like to also come out in the FS uh, blitz, which is a really nice blitz. But I like to mix it up right here with the 3-4 defense. This is kind of like, uh, this is actually the, kind of like the... The 4-3 playbook, but I added the 3-4 just in case, you know, kind of like the training wheels of this defense, you know. So this is what we're doing here. We're mixing it up. The defense with the 3-4 makes it really good. And we're actually sending the blitz off the edge. So he's kind of surprised at what's going on, and he's going to definitely try to go for it. And I got to be careful with anything deep. And I'm going to go ahead and try to activate this blitz right here to go in on the left side. We do have our fastest player there, probably one of the fastest defensive uh, our linebackers in the game he decides to block everybody and just throw it deep over here we did get beat but this time Payne man did not get it there where it was supposed to be but it was a successful defensive stand so we're gonna go ahead and continue now on offense and in offense we again we're running domination uh offense and no, actually the ground and pound offense and we're gonna go ahead and try to see if we could get a nice run to the outside this is a pistol week and here we go and lynch pushing forward and we're keeping uh, here uh, we're keeping moving the ball and we get a nice uh, first down right here with this fullback guy So we're doing pretty good. We're gonna go ahead and finish it off again We're gonna we could audible to a lot of different runs as a thing and we got a lot of quick passes as well and uh, Really it's uh, makes it a lot more challenging for our opponents to stop us now it's time for us to adjust on defense uh, I noticed that he wanted to throw deep. We're gonna go ahead and set up the the Adjustment here and we're gonna go ahead and direct in the middle of the field anything coming across we got that took away that read there He decides to go deep again, but we're playing a cover four, so we're good to go We don't have to worry about that again. We're gonna go ahead and, and uh, Set up over here. This is actually the 4-3 defense once again. He's coming under the center He is probably I feel like he's gonna block everybody he blocks the running back probably pinches the D-line everything so the blitzes won't come in but yet uh, He's throwing to this out route, which is actually really difficult to stop and uh, we're gonna go ahead and just keep seeing it here. The good thing about this 4-3 defense, it does stop the run pretty good. Notice that he come out in the toss. Usually if I was in 3-4, it would lock this shit up. Uh, I mean, it would actually uh, run all over me, but uh, we're locking it up pretty good with this 4-3. So we're gonna go ahead and come out again and set it up. And we're gonna go ahead and lurk the middle of the field. What I like about this defense is that I'm making him block people, man. And uh, making him block people takes away receivers over the top, which under I understand why this guy didn't there's two people on this guy and he actually caught it over two people is the animation to go over and you know he caught it right here for a freaking uh, now he's trying to no huddle me everything and he's gonna punch it in so we can't go without anybody just uh just this is just bullshit man this is man and bullshit but anyways we're, we are running a good offensive scheme here we're gonna go ahead and come out in the inside zone once again this is really Hard to stop because I do have some nice man and zone beaters as well out of this uh, defense coming out right here. Look at this X coming out in man coverage. We got uh, the tight end wide open over here for a first down, and we're gonna go ahead and keep moving the ball. This time we're coming out in strong close toss, and we're gonna make uh, we made actually a really nice read there since I don't know what he was trying to do. Uh, I think I saw his defense was kind of compressed there to the inside. Gonna go ahead and keep moving the ball. It's coming out in goal line defense, real easy, real easy read right here. We take the inside zone. For a nice 
first a down and we get the score for 21 to 7 so we actually just punched it in with a fullback dive coming out in quarters this time around we're gonna go ahead and lurk in the middle of the field he tries to go deep and he almost got me there so i gotta actually put a little bit more prevent defense here and we're gonna go ahead and adjust to what we're doing uh to what he's doing because he's coming out in a lot of bullshit now he's trying to get some of those deep uh catches so we're not gonna let him get his way anyways i like to mix it up with um the fs2 fs3 and uh the three man deep as well i like to mix it up the quarter defense and as you guys can see here this time i switched it up to the fc2 and we get the nice stop so he's probably feeding the heat and he got me here this is like verticals and he got me here for a nice catch so we're gonna go ahead and try to switch it up now this is the three man deep oh no this is just regular i think this is a regular two man under we're gonna go ahead and try to send the blitz on the left side he got me here i noticed that notice that he he's trying to throw to the running back every single time on the left side look at this he, that's his escape route so if nothing's there he likes to throw to the running back every single time so we do is adjust to that notice that we're going to go ahead and send the a gap against uh on the, i mean the b gap on uh, three four right there we send it we come down yep we took his read away and we get the pick so that's how we lock this guy up here and he pretty much quit in this game after talking all that freaking shit uh, right before the second quarter ended so that's pretty good right there guys if you guys need any help with anything feel free to let me know here in the comment section i'll be more than glad to help you guys out anyways uh, i was playing with the seahawks and they have i do gotta have some gameplay with the raiders so stay tuned for that the raiders are actually a pretty fast team so we'll see you guys later don't forget to comment like and subscribe and thank you guys we're at 36,000 subscribers don't forget to tell your friends about this and i already gave away an ebook i'm gonna go ahead and pick another person for a free ebook uh today so thank you guys for watching later your boy shock 360 from animals.com don't forget to check out the new defensive 4-3 guide out of cincinnati playbook at manos.com bye don't forget to subscribe down here below for more tips more strategies more schemes more gameplays more tournaments and more giveaway prices later it's your boy shock 360 hit that like button don't forget comment and subscribe